Hey guys, hey guys, hey guys. So I got my mic on, so hopefully I sound very clear talking to you guys. So here's here's just some tips for you guys. And it saddens my heart, you know, to see people, you know, not really get it, okay? So make sure you subscribe, make sure you share this, uh, you know, with your friends and family and leave a comment um, below, guys. But when I was broke, let me just say this, okay? When I was broke, right, getting rich was far off of my brain. Like, I saw rich people on TV, and that was it, okay? So getting rich was not what I thought was possible, okay? It wasn't until I started to get myself around Okay, that's the first tip, okay? Getting myself around people that were rich or on the train or on the boat to getting rich, okay? When I was broke, guys, I was around all the neg negative people, all the negative bosses, all the negative coworkers, negative family members. I was around the negativity. I was around the people who were broke. I was around the people who couldn't see past their hand. I was around people who's always complaining about bills, right? So when your environment is lack and your environment is only focusing on lack, guess what? You can't think in abundance. You can't think in prosperity. You can't think bigger, okay? Second tip, thinking big and thinking small takes the same energy. It's just you got to channel that energy where you need to channel the energy, okay? So thank God, friends, okay? I, I'm, I'm happy that I got fired from my job in 2011, okay? I'm happy, okay? I lived on unemployment for two years, okay? But while I was living on unemployment, right, I started to get connected to people that were rich. I started to tap into people that had the rich mindset. Now, some people may say, well, how did you get connected to rich people? I joined a business. I started a business, Okay, that's the only way, guys. Okay, I started a business. I got connected to business and wealthy minded people. Okay, so your thoughts, okay, literally become things. So when I was broke, all I was focused on, oh, I hope I can pay my bills this month. And that's not living. It's not living, right? So when I got involved with business, those people that I was now around were able to pull the rich girl out of me and say, you can be rich, Tanisha. You can win. You don't have to live check to check. You don't have to live in bondage. Okay? You don't, right, have to settle for less. Okay? But guys, I joined a business when I was 26, my first business. Okay? But I always had the entrepreneur spirit because when I was in, in high school, I used to make scarves and sell them for like $15, $20. I was making like $200 a month fucking selling scarves <laughs> at school. Okay? So it wasn't until I met a person in the business that was thinking higher than I was and said, you can do it, right? Gave me the confidence to be able to do it. Most people... 99% of people, guys, don't have someone in their corner saying, you can do it. I believe in you. You're going to be the next millionaire in your family. You're going to be the next six-figure earner in your family. People don't have that, right? So thank God I got around. Thank God for my cousin, right? She showed me how to start a business because she was in business and she's still in business to this day, very successful, okay? She showed me. She said, you know what? Don't make no sense work for, for nobody. Work for yourself. Okay. And then I started the business and then I started doing the business. Okay. Now I failed for three years, right? I failed for three years, but guess what? 
in that three years, friends, I was developing my mind. Okay. I was developing the mindset to become rich and to get wealthy. I started putting books like the wealth choice in my head. Okay. This is the recent book that I'm reading right now. The black woman millionaire guys. Okay. You got to implement, you have to put things in your mind. That's going to help your mind expand. Because if you think small, you also can think big. And then I started getting books like this, right? Jab, Jab, Right Hook, right? By Gary V. okay? Talking about telling your story to inspire other people so that other people can now believe that they also can do it, all right? So I started implementing, not just reading those books. I started implementing the things that were in these books. So basically, Dennis Kimbrough's one of my mentors through books. Uh, Dr. Venus, she's one of my mentors through books. And Gary, what is his? Uh, Vinoya Chuck, or Gary V, he's one of my mentors through books. Okay. Now I've hired people. Okay. To show me how to set up a business. I've hired people to show me how to set up my online business. I've hired people to show me how to set up an LLC and come up with a business name and come up with my own products. I've hired people to do this, okay? To help me, okay, guys? No one gets rich alone, right? And, and no one gets rich by yourself. You can't think that you're gonna just do an online business. I'm in my basement and I'm gonna get rich by myself. I have to help people and I have to get help. I have to help people and I have to get help, friends, okay? So this is not rocket science. It's a learned behavior. If you learn what the rich people are doing, you can get rich. But how many of us grew up reading these books? I got my daughter reading this book right now. She's 16, okay? And I got my other daughter reading quotes, successful quotes from people, okay? How many of us grew up reading these books? How many of us grew up reading books that we actually implemented? Because I know people that have read a ton of books, but they never implemented shit, okay? So getting rich, guys, is a learned behavior, right? I feel it in my bones, guys, that I'm going to be the first millionaire in my family, right? And that's huge because nobody's striving besides my cousin. Nobody's striving to become a millionaire, no one's striving to get rich. Everybody's fine with their jobs or they fine with their pensions. No one's striving to get rich. And 99% of people, guys, are not striving to get rich. They're not striving for abundance. They're not striving, guys, for prosperity. Only striving just to pay the bills this month. And that's no way to live. You want to thrive in life, guys, and not just survive, right? 50 Cent said it best. Get rich. Or die trying. So I'm going to die trying. Okay? <laughs> Not, oh, I'm going to get rich. Right? I'm going to die trying. Right? So if I die, I was on the road or on the path to getting myself rich. Okay? See, we don't understand, especially you know, if you grew up in a black area, you know, in the hood, drugs and guns and all this stuff was happening. No one, the most successful person that you probably seen was Oprah on TV, okay? But guys, we are already successful, right? If you want to get next to a successful person, look in the mirror, right? You are already successful. You just need guidance. You need mentors. You need books. You need to attend events. You need to listen to audios and you have to change your mindset. Now, I'm not saying this is easy. It's absolutely not. It's absolutely not easy. But I'd rather spend all my time, all of my energy, all of my money into studying wealth, into studying wealth, okay, than be around other people who are mediocre and can't go nowhere. Getting rich, guys, is a learned behavior. And once you learn the skill, once you learn these behaviors, friends, then you too can now do it. But you need mentors, okay? You need books. 
You need CDs. You need the camaraderie of other energies of people getting rich. You don't just wake up and I'm rich. Now, you can think you are, but if your bank account or your stash ain't reflecting it or your assets ain't reflecting it, then you're not rich, right? So you got to make it catch up. Your mindset literally, okay, has to now move forward and say, I'm going to take action. I'm going to build my brand. I'm going to build my business. I'm going to study wealth. I'm going to study millionaires. I'm going to study the rich. I'm going to get involved with a business that's going to help me get connected to rich people. Most people don't even give a fuck about building something for their last name. They only interested in paying the bills this month. It's a sad thing, guys, when the world is filled with abundance, the world is filled with money. There's money everywhere. There's people everywhere, guys. There's, there's so much everywhere. Sometimes I get overwhelmed. I take five minutes and say, a day and say, thank you, Jesus, for allowing me to be in this mindset to see that everything is plentiful. And I don't have to nickel and dime myself. I don't have to nickel and dime or try to rob people, right? I'm making an honest living from home because I understand that abundance, prosperity, and getting rich, guys, is my birthright. My father, God, has golden floors for us to walk on. But if we don't believe that, then guess what? We're going to continue to walk over the roaches and the rats and shit that we are used to or accustomed to. There's enough money and enough prosperity, guys, for everybody to win. But if you think this small, you can't win. If you never get connected to the energy of people that are winning, you can't win. Okay, you can't win, guys, if you're not implementing information that you're reading, you cannot win. If you are not going to seminars to be around energy, the higher operating energy, you cannot win. This is, you know, this is this is this is what she says. This is what he says. This is what. He says, you want to win, be around others that's winning. You want to get rich, be around others that's getting rich. You want to get rich, read about other people getting rich. You want to get wealthy, read about other people and how they got wealthy. And then implement. And then keep implementing. Because I told somebody today, I said, once you stop investing to grow, you start dying immediately. Once you stop growing and that means investing in tools, investing in books, investing in CDs, investing in yourself and mentors. Once you stop doing that, guys, you immediately start dying. Most people die at 25 and don't make it official until they 75 with the death paper, the death certificate. They died mentally 25 years old and now they're just a zombie walking through life. That's 99% of people. And then at 75 is when they really die physically and everything. But they died at 25. It's a lot of people. You're probably watching now. You probably died at 25. Your, your, your whole intellect has died. Right? You don't have no ambition to go get it. You haven't picked up a book. You haven't listened to a CD. You haven't gotten around millionaires. You haven't implemented anything. That a millionaire have or have told you, or rich people have told you. You haven't hired a mentor in ever. Okay? Everything's learned. That's why it's only a small percentage of people, guys, that win. Because they are willing to do what it takes. Most people only talk about being rich. I'm not talking, guys. I'm doing. Okay? And I'm helping my children do. OK, it's not it's no good just to read this book and say, oh, I read the rough choice. I read the secrets and not do anything. Oh, you know, I read the, the black woman millionaire. Oh, and not do anything. What is the point to know and not to do, guys, is not to know. This is how it works. This is how it goes. The black woman millionaire. OK, to know and not to do is not to know. So getting rich, guys, is a learned behavior. And we all can learn how to get rich, right? So back here, I got power. 
inspiration, act like a success. I'm going to make $2,500 a day. That's what I got up there, $2,500 a day. Who's got my money? I'm a part of the 10X family, okay? I rock. Abundance is my birthright. It's my time, the winning attitude, the compound effect, freedom. So when I come into my office, I see this, and then I got my affirmations, you know, over there. Now I'm going to get some more stuff. I got success is my duty. No negativity. Okay, sell or be sold. I have stuff around me that constantly reminds me that Tanisha, abundance is here. Prosperity is here for you to take. And now that I know that, now it's my goal. And it's now my duty to now tell you, tell others that you also can get rich. But you got to start and implement and keep doing it over and over and over and over again. So I hope I was able to help some people, okay? I hope I was able to help you, okay? Or, you know, if you're sharing this with a friend or a family member, hope I was able to help you guys, you know, kind of, you know, now understand, I'm on my Snapchat, Hope I was able to help you guys now understand that abundance is your birthright. It's your birthright. It's your birthright. But do you believe it? But do you believe it? And if you do, guys, start with this book. Whether you're a man or a woman, don't matter. Let's talk about being a millionaire. The wealth choice. Start with that book, right? Join my class. My class is 97 bucks one time. Okay. We're talking about purpose. We're talking about wealth building. We're talking about mindset. We're talking about expansion. We're talking about growth. We're talking about happiness. Okay. We're talking about moving forward. It's time to win, friends. Time to win, friends. There's too many people losing. Click the link below, guys. See you soon.